how to set up an email account in Incredimail. This tutorial assumes you've already created your new email account in your web hosting account, typically through your hosting control panel. Now let's learn how to set up that new email account in Incredimail so you'll be able to send receive emails to from that new email account from here. Start by clicking the Tools link here. Then click Accounts. The Mail Accounts window appears. Click the Add button. Click here to configure settings manually, then click Next. Enter the name as you would like it to appear in the From field of Outgoing Emails. Then enter your new email address here. Then click Next. Now you have to enter your incoming POP3 and outgoing SMTP server names. These server names will have been provided to you in your welcome email and oftentimes are simply mail.yourdomain.com. Choose POP3 for the incoming mail server setting. Now enter your incoming POP3 and outgoing SMTP server settings in these boxes. Click Next. Now enter the email username as provided to you by your hosting provider. This may be the entire email address, john at demo1234.com, or just the username prefix, john. Then enter your email password here. Click Finish to complete the wizard. The email account has been set up, but there's one more step. Click the Properties button here. Then click the Servers tab. Make sure the outgoing mail server SMTP authentication box is checked. SMTP authentication means that Incredimail will log in to your mail server even when sending emails, not just receiving, ensuring that you are the only one that can send emails from your account. Click the More Settings button. Most SMTP servers use the same username and password as the incoming POP3 servers. Click OK. Click OK again. That's it! We've successfully set up an email account and can now start sending and receiving emails to and from that account from Incredimail. Click the Close button. This is the end of the tutorial. You now know how to set up an email account in Incredimail. Remember that you also have to create that email address in your hosting account before it will work. Thank you for watching our tutorial. Be sure to let us know if you have any questions.